Last uh, one. Bigger to come grim prediction after Toadzilla discovery in Aussie National Park. Toadzilla, it reminds me of, there was a video game, Battle Toads. Yeah. Did you ever play that? Yeah, fun game. Very hard. This reminds me of Battle He looks like a Battle Toad. It was discovered by park ranger Kylie Gray, who was driving through the rainforest in Conway National Park, just south of Airly Beach in the Whit Sundays, stopping her vehicle to let a snake cross, as you would do if you were a park ranger. Uh-huh. She then noticed the toad and gasped at the size of it. I reached down and grabbed the cane toad and couldn't believe how big and heavy it was. We dubbed it Toadzilla and quickly put it into a container so we could remove it from the wild. Well, they, well, they want to study it. They're like, uh-huh. what is going on here? Yoink. Is this some sort of superhero movie where it's been exposed to some kind of mm-hmm. a n- nuclear ooze or uh, some kind of waste and now it's turning into ba- a battle toad? We need to get to the bottom of it. That thing's huge, though. Do they say the weight of it? Uh, it's been splashed across newspapers all over Australia. Uh, oh, they, they, what the? Responding to the fine, Andrew Cox said, did they have to euthanize it? Is that what they said? I guess. I don't know. I don't even know how long these, thing, these things uh, live for. Extraordinary fine could be a bad sign for Queensland. Hmm. The invasion front, they have longer legs than those following them. So what what do they do as far as pests are concerned? Don't they eat mosquitoes and stuff? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe this one eats they must, they, rare birds. They must be invasive. Scroll down further. Uh, animals and birds in warmer climates where Toadzilla was found often evolve to be larger. And Mr. Cock hopes his discovery isn't an indication that this is occurring because bigger animals consume more food. Extraordinary. I'm worried that over time, cane toads in Queensland might all become much larger and therefore... The impacts grow. So just on, I, I suppose, on the balance of the ecosystem and the ability to sustain all the other creatures. If the toads, the toads are eating everything. The toads obviously well fed. They didn't say the, they didn't say the weight. It's just as big as our heads, really. Well, I don't know. It's one of those angle things where, Maybe, but if yeah. I, if it, oh, it says the weight right there. What does it say? 22.7 kilos? Kilos, yeah. 2.7 kilos. You know, you got yourself a five plus pound pounder over there. Like almost That's a, a chunk. Almost a six pounder over there. That's like a giving birth to a baby there, Will. Except, I, except as a toad. If it was fed well. Since it's so big, I guess <clears> it can't really, uh, can it mate? Oh, it can mate already. <laughs> Can it? Yeah. Okay. 